And hello there, and welcome back to yet another fantastic video from Wondershare Dr. Phone. I am Francisco, and today we're going to be taking a look at different methods to resolve the iPhone screen not responding to touch after iOS 16 update. So we will also look at different causes that can result 16 touchscreen issues. So let's start with the main topic. But before that, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell for more content just like this. Now let's dive right in. Part 1. Why is my iPhone screen unresponsive to touch on iOS 16? Well, there are many reasons why your iPhone won't respond to touch after the latest iOS 16 update. The causes largely depend on your iPhone model. For example, if you have an older model like iPhone 10 or 11, there is a high chance that the update is not working properly. So let's go through the very common reasons behind the iPhone screen not responding to touch. Number one is going to be update issues. So iOS 16 updates are configured for the latest iPhone 14 series, and if you have a much older iPhone model, a conflict between older and new codes is likely affecting your device. So this can lead to the iPhone screen freezing or becoming unresponsive. Next is display driver issues. So if there is a bug or glitch in the display driver of your iPhone, it can also lead to the iPhone touchscreen not responding at all or properly. So the bug or glitch can result from some temporary code left in the device due to an update. Next is app issues. So it is also possible that an incompatible or buggy app is causing the screen irresponsiveness, especially if the touchscreen starts behaving abnormally after you open a specific app. So updating or reinstalling the targeted app can resolve this issue. Next up is hardware issues. So the iPhone screen can also become irresponsive due to hardware issues with your iPhone, not necessarily related to iOS 16. Hardware issues can occur due to heavy falls, extreme temperatures, water damage, etc. Part 2. Use Dr. Phone Repair to Fix iPhone Touchscreen So the best tool for repairing issues with the iPhone screen not responding to touch is Wondershare Dr. Phone. It is a one-stop solution for all of the software system issues in your iPhone. This tool can resolve and repair the causes behind your iPhone touchscreen's irresponsiveness in one go. So let's go through the detailed process of repairing an unresponsive iPhone screen via Dr. Phone. So first, connect your iPhone to your computer and then launch Dr. Phone. Click on System Repair on the main interface and select iOS as the device type on the next screen. Then in the next window, tap iOS Repair and it will open a new window where you can select your issue. Here, go ahead and select iPhone touchscreen not working from the device bug category and press repair now. Now you will need to choose one of the two methods available for repair. You can either select standard repair or advanced repair. The standard repair method is recommended as the other one will delete all of the data from your iPhone. After choosing the repair mode, you need to put your iPhone into recovery mode. On your iPhone, select trust in the trust as computer pop-up and follow the on-screen instructions to put your iPhone into recovery mode. And then once the recovery mode has been enabled, a list of different iOS firmware available for installation on your iPhone will appear. So just choose the one currently being used by your device and download it by pressing download. And then just wait for Dr. Phone to download and verify your iOS firmware to avoid further issues. And then after that, just go ahead and press repair now to start repairing your system issues on your iPhone. And once this process is finally completed, tap on the done button to complete the execution. Part 3, how to fix iPhone touchscreen not working after iOS 16 update. So there are also other quick ways to resolve the iOS 16 touchscreen issues if the causes behind it are superficial. So depending on the reasons, we will go through 5 different fixes to resolve the irresponsive iPhone screen issue. Fix number 1 is just going to be to restart your iPhone. So you should first restart your device in your iPhone if your iPhone doesn't respond to touch. So restarting your iPhone will reset all of the processes and remove any temporary bugs or glitches. So the iPhone can be restarted by going through these steps coming right up. First, just open the settings in your iPhone and then select general. Next, scroll down through the new screen and then tap on shut down. A screen will appear with the slider where you need to slide the power button to the right to turn off the iPhone from there. So then just wait a few minutes after the iPhone is turned off. Now press and hold the side button to restart your iPhone. Fix number two would be to force restart the device. So if your iPhone touchscreen is unresponsive and you cannot restart normally, you will need to force restart your device. So here's going to be how you can do so for your iPhone to resolve the irresponsive screen issue.
issue. So first, press and quickly release the volume up button from the left side of your phone. You have to do the exact same thing with the volume down button as well. Now press and hold the side button from the right side and release it after the Apple logo appears. Now just wait for your iPhone to restart and check if the issue is resolved from there. Fix number three is going to be to reset all settings. So restarting your iPhone hasn't resolved the issue of the touchscreen not working properly. So you can also reset your iPhone to its default settings to fix the problem. So let's go through the steps required to reset all settings on your iPhone. First, go to settings on your iPhone and then choose general. Afterward, press transfer or reset iPhone and then tap reset from the next screen. After tapping reset, a menu will pop up where you need to select to reset all settings. Then the phone will just ask you to enter your password for confirmation. Do make sure to provide your password and your device settings will be reset from there. Fix number four, about app issues. So buggy or outdated apps can also cause the, the touchscreen to behave abnormally and become unresponsive. So a simple solution is going to be to update your apps from the app store. So perform these steps to update apps on your iPhone coming right up. So open the app store on your iPhone and then tap on the profile icon from the top right corner. Here, just scroll down to see the list of app updates and then find the target app that is causing issues on your device and then tap on the update button to start the update process. Then once the app is updated, check if the issue is finally resolved or not. If the app is still causing the screen to be frozen or become unresponsive after being updated, you would need to reinstall the app. So just press and hold the app icon and select delete app from the pop-up menu to uninstall it. After that, reinstall the app from the App Store, and then this will help you clear all of the cache or corrupted files of that app from your iPhone permanently. Fix number five, about hardware issues. So have you dropped your iPhone recently or spilled the liquid on it? If yes, then the hardware issues are the most likely reason for the unresponsive iPhone touchscreen. So sadly, there is no easy solution to this problem, and you will need to visit a professional or Apple support center to resolve hardware issues if that is what you're dealing with. So for part four, pros of Dr. Phone compared to other solutions. After going through different fixes for resolving the iPhone screen not responding to touch, it is clear that Dr. Phone is the best way to deal with simple methods like restarting your iPhone or updating apps will only resolve the basic issues. So you will need a system repair tool like Dr. Phone to resolve advanced system issues. Many of its qualities make it an amazing tool. Such are going to be, for example, that it is going to be an all-in-one solution. So Dr. Phone doesn't only resolve the unresponsive screen issue, and can resolve all of the major common system issues of iOS devices. You will not have to look anywhere else after getting Dr. Phone. Also, no data loss. When using its standard repair feature for repairing system issues of your iPhone, your data will not be lost. Quick and simple process. The process to resolve a system issues like the irresponsive screen is quick and easy through Dr. Phone. It will fix any system issue within minutes. It supports all iOS versions. It supports all current versions of iOS being used in the market for resolving system issues. So with that, the video has come to an end. We are hopeful that you were able to resolve the iPhone screen not, not responding to touch with the help of this video. So do share your experience in the comment section and give your appreciation through some thumbs up if you want more tutorials like this one coming soon. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel, of course, and hit that notification bell for more content just like this. So until next time, enjoy.